I could either ask her. Look, your parking spots have anchor chains. That's kind of cool. What's up, everybody? Today we are at Osprey Marina. We don't have Oscar, he's at the uh, shop for service. So, me and Jim are working on a 43 LE Tierra. We got some uh, electrical light issues here, so let's find out what's going on. All right, so this boat has shadow caster, which is a light control function. It actually uses these four wires right here. Supplies power to our black wire here, which doesn't make sense, but that's what it does. And then you have red, blue, and green, which is your colors to your lights. This thing supplies ground in order to make each one of these lights function in different colors. So when you turn this boat on, it would actually light up all of the lights into blue, which means it's got a ground somewhere because the box would be off. You could eliminate the box and you're still getting ground when you should not be getting ground to the blue wire. So we've dug up, dug through this whole boat. And we found number 44 here, this wire had ground still, which it shouldn't. So this is eliminated from it. So after trying to trace everything down and taking the whole freaking boat apart pretty much, let's see. All right, so on the very top of this boat here, we have all of our wiring that comes up for all of our lights in the top, which you can change all the colors and all that fun stuff. Our wires are up here. It actually, these screws right here on each side got screwed into this, into the harness down here. And it caused the yellow wire, which is our ground, to jump to our blue wire, which is the one we found grounded. We just pulled all this out and it went away. So we're gonna fix our wiring here, put everything back together, and then we'll show you how the lights work. All right, so we got our grounds all fixed on our lights here. Let's go to rotate all colors. You can change in between different colors for your underwater lights, all that. If you look, this whole thing has different ambient lighting everywhere around it. It goes to music, it does whatever you want it to, change whatever color. All the little lights everywhere. And even the underwater lights also match. You got blue, changing colors. All right, so our tier behind us is all done. We're going to move on to the next couple things. Nothing really worth filming here, but we have some marinas to go to. It was a couple hour drive down here. So we're gonna go, if I see some cool boats or something, I'll film them. So let's go. All right, we made it to Longboat Key here. This is our last stop. We just had to check and see. The spotlight down there, it's got a bad module, so we gotta get a part for it. This is a really cool marina. Let me show you the boats and stuff. I'm up on top of this one. Lots of big boats in here. That's a cool trawler right there, this guy. That guy's cool. Well, that concludes today's travels. I'll see you tomorrow. He looks like he's not happy about it. <laughs>